imagine waking up in The Last of Us. The city is infected with a spiraling out of control spore disease. The virus mutates the buildings, animals and humans. Bandit factions roam the streets. I have to scavenge for bare necessities like food, water and ammunition. The world will be nuked in 100 days. Will I reach the bunker civilization or fail? Tune in to find out. Thirty days after evacuation, commencing purge in 100 days. Okay. Ah, our first infected. What? He has a bow. Oh, we spawned in beside a little boat. Let's check this place out. Holy. Okay, we can see some bodies and also a chest. Inside is a shotgun and a book and quill. Avenge me, destroy these parasites, and make your way to the faction. Let's get this boat out from this, uh, from this water. Guys, I'm a little bit scared going into the city. What if there's too many infected? Oh, get this guy. Oh, that's it. We got him. Let's reload the shotgun. Get his loot. Let's also get a little bit of cows. Oh, oh, we got one more. He's a quick one. Reload, reload. Oh, there we go. There we go. Um, this is scary. This is very scary. Oh, we see something here. Oh no, no, this is this is not what I think it is. Oh, that's insane! The blood all over the place. It's it's crazy. So from this chest, we got a flare gun, which I will not use right now because that would not be the smartest decision. And also a pig brew. Okay, I think I think this is uh, this is a good loot drop. Let's go inside this building because I can not see a little furnace here. Let's quickly break a few windows. Whoop out my weapon at the ready. Okay, so far so good. Even though there are a lot of uh, undead creatures all over the city. Let's cook up, cook up some meat like this. Let's also craft guys a little armor piece. I think we have a lot of iron. Yes, we do. We have so much iron. I know, I'm gonna combine a leather tunic and also a... Oh, okay, I'm gonna do this. Hello? No! Don't come near me! No! I did not want to do that, but look at this. So I can finally get myself some uh, some good armor. I feel a lot better already. Let me see how my meat... Oh, my steak is completely ready. Cer Cerebrum. I don't think we need all of this garbage, but we will keep it just in case. I do want to leave the city for a little bit to get some more gear, but look at this. Someone left this place here. What is this pig? Is it? Are you okay, buddy? C can I can I eat him? I, I don't think I can eat him. But yeah, I did run past that. Oh, two zombies even. Yeah, the zombies are super special infected. Yeah, just like this guy. They can shoot bows and do all sorts of tricks. Oh, look at this, guys. We found... An airplane and also a campfire. Okay, so this is this is pretty good, but how would I go down here? I can climb down these leaves and hope for the best, I guess. Yep, just like this. Yep, yep, like that. Oh yeah, beautiful. I know I heard or seen I think a big monster somewhere here, but I don't see it anymore. We are in. Oh no! What is that? No, no, no! Oh no! Re reload, reload, reload the double barrel. See here? Yeah. He oh, I think he infected me. Let me see. Hunger 57 and mucilum infection. Hello? Anyone here? No? Oh look, a brewing stand. I can see that there are infected humans, husk, and like um, some sort of spells and also weapons in this mod pack. So I think that's what I will be focusing on crafting. And one guy did just spawn in. Let's get this. Oh no. Let's get this guy. Oh, he's a beefy one. He's a beefster. Look at this, guys. We did get the backpack. So we now have a backpack. Let's go. Oh, that was too close for comfort. Or right, where, where are they coming from? Let's eat some steak. Oh, I can see that I can ride this airplane, but I do I have enough fuel.
It's good that it did start raining because I think the rain will draw out my uh, sound and smell and they won't come after me. So the zombies, the infected, they are super, super dangerous. So let's just get some watermelons, which we are pretty lucky in finding. Oh, what happened here? Let's place a crafting bench over here and look at that, guys. There are some towers that look super creepy in the night. Too bad I can't see them from here, but it seems like they are maybe some radio towers. Maybe I can make use of them, but for now, I will be crafting myself some, uh, some weapons if I can, at least. No, I do have some components missing. Let me see. What can I craft? Luckily for me, this guy did have a little bit of also zombie parts. It seems we can craft an infected saber. Let's check this out. Is it a good weapon? I'm not really sure. Now, if we ever run out of ammunition, I can equip my shield and I can fight. Whoa, this sword is way bigger than I thought. What damage does it do? Eight attack damage. Okay, okay. This is, uh, this is nice. Seems I can also craft a few armor pieces. And if I combine them both, I will get a living helmet, which I think is uh, pretty badass. Yep, okay, okay. I look pretty cool. Not a lot of zombies are spawning in around us for whatever reason. Oh, look at this. We see a chest. Let's go. Get this chest real quick. We have some potatoes and some wood, which I will take. Oh, uh, there's one. I can see one. Okay, so just like, just like in the, the actual universe of The Last of Us, I need to be a little bit careful. Oh damn, I'm getting attacked. What is this? What is this thing? Oh, okay, I'm gonna whip out my gun. Gonna whip out my double barrel. No, run, 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 run. What is going on? How much health does this, does this guy have? What is that thing? It's like a dog. Wait, no more ammunition. Oh, oh, whoa. Okay, he nearly got me. This is insane. Oh, it is starting to rain, but look at this. We found an anvil. Anvil is pretty useful, so I will grab it. Hold up, what is that? Another chest. Oh, what is that thing? No, get away from me. Get away. No, no, this is insane. I'm making too much of a noise here. I need to really calm myself down. Get this guy. Get this guy. Come on. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay, yeah. This is, uh, this is getting pretty dangerous. I really need to watch my back. One more outside. Okay, so it seems a new type of mob appeared. But I can probably, I can probably survive them if I just shoot them like this. Oh, yes, let's go. That chest was here. Oh, yeah, that's it right there. Okay, um, let's go in. Oh, no. No, traps, traps. Okay, quickly, quickly. Can I even destroy these traps or should I go through the window? Okay, we're gonna go through the window. Guys, there are traps here. Okay, interesting interesting and we also have some blood particles okay so it seems this is not just a random chest it seems it's a oh look at that another trap okay so hopefully there will be some major loots here a, li a little bit of blood everywhere but we also did get let me see what did we get okay we got a tumor no that's not good we have some claymores let's go a hog bonker 12 gauge buckshot hold up it's the same type of shotgun I already have, so I guess I guess I can take it. We can quill so another flare gun, which is pretty nice, and also of course a note. Let's read it. Fifty six, fifty six, and then we have some coordinates. Okay, okay, that's that's easy enough. So this must be the place. Oh yeah, there. Oh, right on the spot it seems. Okay, so it seems. Uh, I should have... No, this is not the same tower that I was on, no? No, I saw maybe another one from the distance. I, th I think this is like a different one. Either way, we did find a leave sign. It says leave. Oh, another sign. Oh, no. What's going, what's going on? What's happening? 
Oh, it's barbed. It's not. It's not a fence I can jump on. Holy. Okay. Okay. Get out. And we also do have a little bed that we can jump on even. <laughs> yeah, but um, either way, I'm pretty sure this 56, 56. Let's hope for the best. Let's go. We we won. We won, guys. We won. So let's take the arrows, magma cream, another backpack, shift for special ability, ability available for item. Oh, wow. I, I have no clue what that means, but I will take it. Yes, sir. And we did also get a lot of barbed wire and obstacle, it seems, which we can use to do something, I guess. Oh, I forgot. I do have ammunition in my backpack. Okay, that's good. Let's actually put the stuff that we don't need for now into the backpack. So like the razor and like barbed wire and stuff like that. And just let's take um, scatter bomb sack into the inventory. Okay, seems seems nice. Seems nice. Let's jump over this barbed wire, try not to get stuck on this one. But yeah, here we go. This is looking pretty interesting. Guys, do you think this magma backpack is like bigger? Um, oh no, it's not bigger. Never mind. I thought maybe it would be a little bit bigger, but I don't think it is. Hold the phone, guys. I think this backpack gives me like fire protection or something. I I'm not sure, but I will check. And look at us for a new shiny backpack. Yep, this seems this seems a lot better. I like it. Oh yes, let's go. We finally made it to the outskirts of the city, and it seems we're going into a bamboo bamboo type of deal. Oh, by the way, we didn't check out the shotgun yet, so let's check this one out. Okay, it seems like it's uh, specialized. It's a double barrel, I can see. And it does not support any modifications. What about the double barrel? Nope, neither does the double barrel. But the double barrel, I've, I've had it for so long. I'm so used to it now. This one, I just hope it does... Uh, oh, it does a little bit even more damage. It's fine. Uh, a weapon upgrade is never, is never bad. So I kind of like it. It seems the cave system does not have a lot of zombies, so um, the caves are pretty safe. Yep, that's a safe bet if you want to survive the the actual apocalypse. But we do not want to survive the apocalypse. The first note I remember re reading a couple of days ago, it did say to find a faction. So I assume that there are civilizations which are waiting for me to uh, find them and maybe kind of uh, get together and do something. But yeah, for now, it's a struggle just to survive the very, very special infected. Oh, it seems it is nighttime, guys, from the outside. Okay, I'm gonna get my weapon out just in case any infected jump, jump at me. Okay, I think it is uh, maybe, maybe it's becoming lighter. I'm not really sure about the time. Oh no, the moon is literally right overhead us. That maybe means I will go back and see the depths, but you know what? Oh, look at that chest. But you know what? I oh, empty. Okay, I will actually create myself um some carts and maybe go along this tunnel. Holy! I think we're going underwater. Yeah, we are. Look at this. Okay, this is pretty badass. It seems, guys, we are going underwater, so we must hit like a different maybe biome at some point or like a different city. Oh, something definitely loaded in. Something huge, I think. Maybe a very big city, so yeah, that'd be pretty badass. But either way, so far so good. We are on a grand adventure looking for survivors, I guess. The cart left us, but you know what? At least I can go out finally. Okay, because uh, the ocean is pretty much endless. Oh, and we are beside a little island and maybe the shoreline. Oh, I can see that there are special infected all the way from here, which is uh, pretty interesting. I think he's going at me. Okay, let's uh, let's use the new weapon. Oh, whoa, the new weapon is actually pretty sick. They can walk in water? What, bro? No. No, did they see me? I think they did. Okay, I need to get up. Get up. I need to get up somehow. Anyone around here? Oh, yeah, there are. There are mobs everywhere around here. What is that thing? Okay. Okay, let's go. One shot, two shots. Back away a little bit. Three, four. Okay, so four shots to take down one of these guys. Oh, there we go. Let's get their loot because with their loot, we can actually craft a lot of things. Oh, so it seems this is actually an island. Oh, wow. That's interesting. 
Let's put on, by the way, the flesh, uh, the flesh leggings, and not the iron leggings, because the flesh leggings, I can upgrade them with, um, with, like, living cores and fleshy claws and stuff like that to get a living helmet. So we got flesh, bone, and if you combine them, you've got a living helmet, and it's, like, even more OP. But yeah, I can see that there are some enemies inside. Oh yeah, look at that one. That's a nasty one. He doesn't see me though, so I think we're just gonna ignore it for now. Oh, I can see a body. Oh, and also a doctor. Okay, so it seems that that is the point of interest on this island. So we will check it out, but we will be very careful. Yeah, we will check our behind at all times. So let's reload, uh, reload the weapon. Come on, let's... I'm gonna use the double, the old school double barrel then. There we go. I think we ran out of, like, ammunition. 12 gauge shots. So I will get myself another crafting bench and craft... Oh, well, maybe I didn't have to craft the crafting bench because I do have a backpack. But I will craft a bow. Now, if I can make a sword, that means I can craft a bow. But the bow, I'm pretty sure li Living Core goes in the middle. Fleshy claws, I believe, go like this. And then maybe... Yes! Look at me go! Infected bow. Okay, okay, so there we go. Do I have any arrows? I think I did. Yeah, I have 17 arrows. So we did upgrade. Holy, this bow is insane! Look at the size of this thing! Oh, I can see that the zombies are roaming that room there. Okay, so I will be a little bit more careful. Maybe I should place some mines. Okay, I know that you guys are here somewhere. Come on and peek. I know you want to. Where are you guys at? Oh, there we go. That's that's them. Okay, let's use the bow on this guy. Oh, take aim. Yes, that's my first time shooting a bow. Oh, the bow is actually pretty powerful. And there we have another one. Oh, the third person. Look at the bow. Oh, and I missed. It's so huge. It's insane. Why is it so big? It's not supposed to be that big. I mean, the bigger the better, right? Why is the blood green on these guys? And what's wrong with this guy? Okay, so it seems this was maybe like a hospital of some sort or, or like a med med medical like assembly point for the infected. But the blood... Oh, let's go grappling hook. Let's go. Okay, so it seems we did decide to stop like on this island, which is a point of pretty good interest, which is nice. I'm going to check out some more rooms, of course. I'm not going to leave it just like this, but it is pretty cool. Anyone? No, no one. Let's keep on going down. Oh, we, we see some blood. That means maybe there will be some mobs. Nope, not here. Not here, I think it's just a chest. Yes, it is just a chest, but look at the amount of, amount of blood here. Only one flamer. Magma cream, holy... Wait, is this what I think it is? <laughs> it is a flamethrower. So it seems I, I got a flamethrower from this island. Okay, that's that's actually really, really cool. I really like this. Guys, I think it's about time that you do know what I'm about to do. <laughs> it's been a long time coming, but here we are today, and we will be riding the biplane all day. Let's, let's set this baby up. Let's see, what type of runway does it need? I think I'm gonna send the airplane maybe this direction, so I will open up like a little... <laughs> a little a, l a little field that he can uh, jump from, or I can jump from at least. Okay, there we go. So the plane will go straight. Hopefully, we, can, we will crash into the water and nothing bad will happen. So yeah, let's place this bad boy on the runway. Oh, look at it go. Beautiful, and it's even lagging or something. So I think I need to uh, press ammunition on this dude somehow. Wait, 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 wait. It's already going. It's already going. I didn't even place no ammunition in it. Well, there we go. We're up, up, and away. L look at us go. Okay, this is amazing. This is, this is pretty amazing, guys. I'm really enjoying this. Okay, so, oh, I can see also the underwater... Um, train tracks so i think we were going this direction so let's keep going this direction so we must have uh, exited oh and now it either goes right or left we're gonna go right you always go right when you can because then you know that you're always correct so go straight okay we're gonna just continue going straight hopefully hopefully we'll go somewhere oh didn't take too long guys now did it 
we did meet a um, shore pretty quickly. So I, I might have to find a place to land this bad boy and continue on by foot, maybe. Oh, there's nether portal. I would like to get the nether portal chest, which is uh, it's down here. Let's try and get it. Oh, no. No, no, no. Careful, careful. Wait, huh? Okay, I'm going to land here. I'm going to land by the beach. Oh, this is insane. No, no, no. Please, please, please. Just get get down. That's it. That's it. Boom. That's it. Let's go. Anyone try, trying to attack me? No? No, I think I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> I've got my flamethrower ready, and look at this. We can't see- oh, 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 they are coming up from behind me as well. Wait, why am I going so quickly? What's going on? Okay, let's actually go back here and see the open. Oh, I'm like getting- getting swung. Oh, I think they're literally using magic on me. Okay, let's try and use the flamethrower. Oh, hold up, is it that good? Holy, okay. Okay, this is- this is pretty cool. I like the flamethrower. Wait, I need to reload it? Wait, is the magma cream still in my backpack? That's not good. Okay, it seems shotgun time. Oh yeah, let's reload the shotgun, reload the shotgun. This is actually pretty dangerous. These guys are very, very strong and I do not have big armor upgrades. So if they catch me, it's maybe GG. So I think I need to kite them very carefully. Oh, look at, look, they're like dropping all sorts of stuff. Okay, let's do this, like that. Okay, okay, now I'm gonna use uh, this. I'm gonna use my sword. He picked up a sand block! Why did he pick up a sand block? That's insane! What is he doing with it? Is there a reason why he picked it up? And this guy as well, look at that! Look at that, he picked up a sand... sand! That's, that's crazy! The feller is biting me! Come on, how much health does, do you have? I'm telling you guys, this is a pretty serious mod pack. If I was not prepared, I would not probably survive this. And there we go, that's the chest that we've been fighting all this time for. We do have some obsidian, flint, pick, and also a flint. Okay, you know what? Not good. Not worth it. Not worth it at all. No. Why is this so difficult? But either way, uh, we're chilling. We're chilling as long as we don't get attacked by a big horde of zombies. Uh, we are chilling. Oh, I think maybe we are near something interesting because this place looks a little bit more decorated than, uh, than it should be. So I think we're maybe somewhere close. Look at that! Oh! He picked them up! What? That creature picked up another creature! What is going on, guys? What is going on? But either way, my FPS is lagging a little bit if I look in this direction. So you see, very normal, and then not, not so much. So I think there should be something good there. Okay, let's take it bit by bit. Let's get rid of these guys. Get this guy, this guy again. Let's reload the shoddy. Like that, like that. No, get away from me. Get away from me, you pest. Ah. No, get away from me. Ah, yeah, there we go, there we go. Oh, one of them is like flying even. Okay, he picked up a grass block. No, you can't pick up, pick up a grass block. That's against the rules. You can't be breaking the world. They just don't stop. Yeah, they just spawn in. They just keep spawning in. Okay, I think we need to head into this building ASAP. How does it look? Oh, I can see that this is like... Oh, I see. I see what this is. Oh, nice. Nice. Let's let's close it like that. So we did close the literal kind of uh, doors. So we are chilling here now. And there goes my FPS. Yes, it is. It's that guy. He's standing right there. Okay, let's uh, use the bow on him. Is he scary looking? What is that? Ugh, what? What is that thing? Okay, um, I think I have... I do have scattered bomb sacks. So let's uh, try and throw one at him. Okay, we got him once. Twice. Three times. Four. Five. Six. Now let's go with... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh yeah, yeah, the FPS, it's that guy. He's eating up all of my resources. He's very unoptimized. Are you gonna attack me or no? 
Okay, it seems he does have a lot of health, so he's like the really beefy type. He is protecting a chest. So let's get this guy, get this guy. Holy, how, how, how many ammunitions does this heat take? You know what, guys? I think I'm gonna use a flame thrower on this guy. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Flame thrower. Now, let's go up close. Close and personal. Oh, we got him. We got him. Oh, we got him. Let's go. Let's put out the fire quickly. Put out the fire. No zombies coming in from behind. No. Nope. Okay, something good. Please. Come on. Something good. Coal? No. Ex 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 extra dry ration? Okay, so I think we found food. Maybe this is food and we will also find a weapon, which is uh, always welcome. You know what? I'm gonna throw my last sack of scatter bombs, maybe at uh, someone from up here. Uh, this this place does seem like it was maybe a military outpost, judging by the military personnel and also the dead carcasses and stuff like that. And maybe the bunker inside feeling even. But yeah, it's uh, getting pretty cold. Let's throw this. Oh, damn. Someone hit me from behind. Oh, no. Okay, let's go, guys. Let's go. My health is very, very low. I am not trying to uh, be game-ended over here. We can't see a village. Oh, damn. Run. Run, 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 run. Okay, um, I need food, and I need food ASAP. Wait, 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 little villager. Do you guys trade anything? No, no, you don't trade anything good. Okay, I need to find maybe a hut that I can sleep in. This place does seem pretty good. Copper ingots, let's uh, take them away. Oh, we did also get, get some heavy ammo and a steampunk chest plate at some point. So let me see. Five armor and one armor toughness or six armor, but 10% explosion resistance. You know, I am using um, a flamethrower and maybe... Um, Maybe some explosive power. At least I will at some point. Let's see how this looks. What is this? Oh, whoa, it moves. Wait, since when do I look so cool? Did I always look this cool? Either way, um, I really, really enjoy this. Oh, and we also get a little time clock on the bottom. Oh, I think, I think a zombie came in. I think a zombie shot itself in that hut. Okay, yeah. It is daytime, but it is no longer... A storm, it's like peaceful. Yeah, it's pretty peaceful. You know what? Maybe we can even go out. Oh, he's running from someone. <laughs> oh, and we do also have guardians here, which is uh, always appreciated. But let's check out the carbine. I'm pretty sure this is a weapon I can use. Oh, it looks so cool. What ammunition does it take? Light ammunition. I think we have some light ammunition in the backpack from the initial, initial uh, backpack that we found. Yep, let's go. So, uh, if we could only find a mob that we could shoot at, that'd be pretty cool. But let's just try and shoot maybe, uh, some glass. I mean, some, some of this. Oh, whoa. Okay. Let's reload it. Okay. Seems pretty cool. I'm now, like, military certified. Flying through the storm is a little bit difficult because we don't see anything, but we do see a tower. Okay, so does this one have a secret pin coated chest around it no this one is uh solo mode oh but there is a secret dungeon look at that guys a secret dungeon inside of a uh, inside of stone but you know what maybe it's a little bit too difficult for us to get over there but yep yeah, here we are surviving somehow and turns out this um uh, my new chest piece does also have a little cloak oh we finally left oh no we're coming back into the snow zone where is this the last piece of it is this the last one? Oh yeah, I think we're out. Yeah, we're out, definitely. <laughs> but it seems I have a compass on my shoulder. On my left shoulder, I have a compass. On my back, I have a cloak. And on the left side of my hotbar, I have a... I have a time clock. What is wrong with this suit? And then there's also, like, parts moving on it, which is, like, even more weird. No way. We finally hit shore. I thought it would never end, guys. It's insane how long I traveled. The ocean is very, very big. I mean, uh, I mean, it's just a couple of minutes, I guess. Maybe I shouldn't be complaining as much, but it's a lot longer than I was uh, expecting. Let's uh, land this bad boy like this. Is this a good place? Or should we uh, maybe go to a different place? It's loading right in front of me. Okay, you know what? L let's stop right here. 
Oh uh, yeah, this place, maybe it looks pretty good for a base. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna get my shield out just in case. Get off this bad boy. Now let's break it. Let's break it and take it. Come on, I know I know I know you want to be broken. Ah, oh, there we go. Yes. And I can't pick it up. What's wrong, guys? It's like it's like something is weird going on. But either way, either way, we do have a new weapon and we are pretty geared. Oh, there we go. We picked it up now. That's it. We we can go in peace now. <laughs> but yeah, we are going into new lands, it seems. And new tunnels and new adventures. So it would be wise to maybe look for a secret entrance that we can baseify because I do have a lot of materials that I can create a base with. Where are, where are all the villagers? Are they inside? No. Hello? Anybody in the village? Oh yeah, there we go. That's one. Okay, so it seems uh, seems this village survived the onslaught, the apocalypse. Oh, that building looks uh, pretty alone. I'm looking for a building that is like sort of alone, like in a field maybe, and that would make like for a simple uh, landing pad for my airplane. Let's fortifying the fences, stuff like that, guys, it would be a lot easier. Maybe something like this, yeah, maybe this is good. Or should we go deeper into the city? Oh, look at that, there's one, and he is grabbing me with his superpower. Okay, let's, uh, oh, whoa, okay. And even that thing, his arm had a health pot of its own. Okay, so it seems, um, oh, wow. Look at those fly fishies. They're even flying from the water. Okay, you know what? I like this place. I can fish here. Oh, oh, I am getting pulled in by another one of those types. Oh, yep, there he is. There we go. Is your hand destroyed as well? I think it... Oh, oh, even more, even more. Even more. Where, where's that guy at? Oh, he's gonna destroy my health here. Okay, let's, uh, let's use the grappling hook. Oh, yep, there he is, there he is. Okay, oh, and he, he, he made me stuck. I'm stuck, guys! Oh, there we go. Oh, there's so many of them! Okay, yeah, this is a bad place. Yeah, this is a bad place for a base. Wait, is he holding? Ah, uh, never mind, never mind. Okay, let's, uh, just take out these, uh, these walkers over here. Okay, you know what? Bad place for a base. Very bad spawn rate for, uh... For, for the grappling guys, I can't even walk straight, look at me. Oh, we found a witch and we found our first diamond. So we are unlucky in that regard, so let's get the witch. Oh, she's still alive, one last shot. No, one last, come on, I can do this. Wait, how? the witch is like beefier than regular mobs. Look at that, I even got an achievement, is this my first vanilla mob? That's insane. Okay, well, either way, we do see some slimes, something on the ground over there, but most importantly, we came here for diamonds, and look what we got. We got, oh, we got two diamonds, not even one. We, oh, not even two, not even four, five diamonds, holy, okay, okay, guys, we got five diamonds. Now, that's amazing, that's amazing. I should be looking for more diamonds around this area. Oh, but this area underground does look pretty dangerous because of them creatures. Yeah, them guys. By the way, I can use my flare gun in this area and see if it's uh, if it's gonna be lit litted up. We can try it out here. I know it's closed indoors, but that's the point, right, guys? Whoa, let's go. Okay, so the flare gun is definitely working, but um, I'm not sure if it's uh, <laughs> doing anything useful. You know what, I have two flare guns, I'm gonna throw this one away. I don't need that one. It doesn't have any ammunition anymore. I do have another one in my backpack though. Look at that, even more diamonds. Let's go baby, that's what I came here for. For a lot of diamonds. And uh, maybe traveling underground a little bit. Because I'm kind of not sure on, on, on where my base should be. Should I make it underground so it'd be like a lot easier to defend myself against mobs? Or should I make it um, overhead, like in the overworld somehow, and have it be normal, I guess? What is that thing? It drowned in lava. Nah, you know what? This place is too weird for me. I, I think I need to leave this one. No. You can't be serious, guys. Look how many diamonds there are. It's like, it's like just stacks of them. It's like stacks on stacks on stacks. Look at that. And we did also find another cave system. 
interconnecting. Is that even more diamonds? And even more diamonds? Okay, guys, we are pimping. Holy, do you see this? It's like I'm gonna return with a stack. Like, first mining expedition for diamonds, and I'm gonna return with, like, a stack of diamonds. It's insane. But hopefully I can use it to craft, like, pretty good armor and equipment. Maybe I can use it to enhance my weapons as well. Because that would be very, very much appreciated. Look at this, guys. I think we found the perfect base. First of all, it's made from, like, some hard blocks. Second of all, it's not destroyed. Third of all, it's not interconnected to, like, other smaller buildings apart from this one. Third of all, I don't think you can walk through it. No, you can't. You can't. That's good. So it's not broken. Fourth of all, it's, like, on the outskirts of a city, I guess. And, like, so... I can probably make use of this, so you know what? I think it's about time, guys. Let's get the razor wire, the barbed wire, the everything we need, and let's get to building, because uh, that's that's how we're gonna build. So let's uh, just put this here, diamonds here, let's get this bad boy over here. We can place some claymores, uh, but later, not now, uh, to kind of maybe even more fortified against uh, upcoming zombie invasions. But first of all, let's just put a little bit of barbed wire. Barbed wire should go maybe around the base. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, you know what? Maybe just the entrance. Maybe just the entrance would be a little bit better. So let's, let's do this. Get away these trees like that. Now let's get some barbed wire. I will not be the one answering the base. So uh, I guess it's uh, fine if I do this like that. There we go. Now let's uh, get some traps like this. I know, guys, that the tra traps are, like, placed randomly, and it's not super creative. But the zombies will be walking all over the place. And is that really necessary for me to, um, fortify the base in a way that the zombies would, like, not walk through? The zombies will be very random. And, uh, me? I won't be. I'll be just using my <laughs> grappling hook, sort of like this. Test run. Yeah, perfect. Perfection. The grappling hook is beautiful. Oh, let's uh, let's be careful not to fall into the pits. <laughs> Just place a few more like this, and a few more like this. Oh yeah, it's this is a minefield. It really is. No way they are walking through here. There is no way. Let's give some love to the other side as well, in case they do decide to maybe flank me a little bit. There we go. So for now. This is some good baseline fortification. Now I can proceed and work around in the base. Can I actually walk through this? Ow, ow, I, I guess I can, I guess I can. Oh, I need the fallout doors, bro. Okay, guys, I'm gonna be back in a minute. I need to find another kind of uh, laboratory or like a, a, a boss, a boss room where I can steal the doors from. Guys, it's like this thing is literally trying to make me mad. Look at that. I think that's the fallout kind of shelter there where we can take the doors from. But look, it's like on a cliff or something. What is that? Well, how, how do I get there? I mean, at least I have a plane. So that's, that's good. Okay, to get the plane running, we need a runway. To get a runway, we need good weather. Is the weather good, guys? I don't think it is. So, uh, oh, there's a Mr. Cow. It's good that it's raining, in fact, in fact because uh, when it's raining, it's a little bit easier to traverse. Because the zombies don't spawn as much. And it's like, I guess it's like sort of they lost my scent or something like that. So I guess it's like cool with me. It's easier, definitely, playing in the rain. Oh, there we go. That's, uh, there we go. I think this is going to be the, the launching pad over here. Yes, it will be. Let's go. I'm gonna get them doors. I need them doors. It's very aesthetic for my, for my days. Let's place this bad boy like this. Get in. Start it up. Let's uh, head for like a little exit that we have here. Oh yeah, there we go. Good, good, good. Okay, now let's make a U-turn. Let's try and get up to this cliff side. Oh yes, there it is. I can see it. You're so close to me. Wait. Wait, what? It's floating and there's icicles below it? 
What is this? It just keeps getting weirder and weirder and weirder by the minute, guys. But you know what? I'm gonna land my plane here. I'm gonna land it, we're gonna get out, we're gonna take it, and we're gonna do what we must. We came here to get the doors, and we will get them. Ah, oh, beautiful. Look at that. Can I break one? Oh, let's go, baby. Can I please break it? Yes, let's go. Look at these doors. They're gonna be all mine. Yep, stainless steel, concrete proof, frozen, reinforced door. And I'll even take this. Yep, I'll even take this. Why craft uh, a lock of my own if I can just do that? You guys want to have a little... <laughs> a little free fall on the way home? I want to. Let's try this. Woo! We're falling and we're good. Good, good, good. Now we can uh, safely ride back home. Let's get these iron doors out of the way. Move, move. Okay, let's go. Oh, they look so good. Let's get a lever going. Oh, whoa, okay, that's beautiful. And I, I can close them and look at this, it's reinforced. The glass is reinforced as well, which is uh, pretty nice. We do have some doors here that I, that I could probably block off or like double down in case they kind of try and go through you. Because this is the main entrance, guys. This is the main entrance. Speaking of main entrances, I need to find a way to get myself out. <laughs> There's no lock on this side of the door, but yeah, this is the inside of the base. Pretty empty so far, but we will fill it up with all the necessities. I think this is gonna be the main room. Let's actually get some torches already like this. You know what? On every pillar. Yeah, 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 like this. Holy, okay. This is, this is looking pretty, pretty that damn good. Let's also get a backpack going, open it up like this. This way we can sleep here and we don't need to take off our own uh, Blaze backpack. That should be giving us protection from the fire. Let's also get some chests going. Okay, I do have a lot of wood, but I don't have a lot of materials. So I'm not really sure what will be in my base, but I can say for a fact that... Oh, well, there will be one chest and there will be more. There will be plenty more, like this. There we go, that's good. Four chests. Okay, let's place them sort of maybe um, like this. Yeah, like that. There we go. Okay, um, so far, so empty and <laughs> not extravagant. Maybe I should go looking for more loot. <laughs> when you eat um, the ext extra dry rations, guys, you do lose a little bit of vitality, I guess, and you do get like a little black debuff, but it's not a problem. We can't see that there are in the distance some crazy, some crazy mobs. Ain't no way we just stumble upon this. Okay, so it seems that traveling does pay off, guys. A tombstone and a little house and, and a lot of zombies. Okay, I need to be real careful because I don't want to actually attract any of them, like this guy. This guy here. Hopefully, the other guys won't hear my shots. Let's get rid of this guy. Come on. Yep, I know. Last shot, maybe. Come on. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm gonna finish you off with a... With a sword. Let's go. Don't touch the pig. Oh, yes. There we go. There we go. Let's get his loot. Because with, the, with his loot, we can actually craft ourselves everything that we need. Them guys luckily don't see me. And this place is free. Okay, um, them guys still don't see me. That's good. Are they still walking? Yeah, they're still walking there. Okay, so we see a lot of chests. We see a music disc. And what I assume is a jukebox behind me, so we can play some music. Can we insert some music in this bad boy? I don't think we can. Okay, either way. we. What is this? Avalon's boots? Two armor? Five armor? What? Holy, okay, let's put this back here. That's nice. Wait, what did I also pick up? I picked up a bed. Do I really need a bed? I don't think I do. Okay, you know what? Oh, they're coming. They are coming, bro. Quickly, quickly. Ah, yes, there we go. Made it just, just in the nick of time. Come on, baby, something good. Yes, let's go. We did get something good. We got intelligent munition systems, which is, I don't know what that is. We got some cooked pork chops, which we don't actually need. Some coal, which we don't need either, and also a repeater. I think this is a... 
I think this is a super modded weapon. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Okay, bro. Okay, um, let's then get out from here by getting a hole dug like this. Now let's do this. Let's jump up. There we go. So the tombstone... Wait, hold up. Are you telling me the tombstone guy, like, climbed out from the tombstone? And he, like... Is this him? Is this the guy? Oh, hey, look at that, guys. That's a sword going through his body. Wait, this is a TV. You know what, guys? I did say that we don't have actually... Um, uh, oh, no. I broke the TV. Oh, no. We are getting some attention here. I did say, guys, that we don't have enough props back at the base. Like, some cool stuff that's going on. So, maybe... Maybe this would be pretty cool. You know what? I'm gonna take his gravestone. Don't worry, bro. I'm gonna take your gravestone and I'm gonna be... Oh, damn, bro. Okay, um... Is it worth it, guys? Is it worth it? Let's let's try out the repeater. Wait, is this a one-shot weapon? Is this a one-shot weapon? Who's shooting me? Am I still poisoned? Uh, it's th that guy. Oh, look at that, guys. The actual tombstone. We can pick it up. Since when did I get plated leggings? I can literally combine them, I think, like this. Or maybe like this. Or like this. Or like... Oh, no, my health. Run, 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 run. Okay, guys, uh, it is no longer a joke. I need to get out from here. I'm gonna go sleep in that building. This dungeon that we walked past, which probably belongs to this witch, is uh, is our safe bet. Let's go, let's go. Three, three hearts. Witch, get away from there. This is my base now. I need to survive the night somehow. Let's get in and hope no one is gonna follow us. I think it's safe here. Yeah, I can assume it is safe. Thanks for having me. Wait, I, di I didn't even get these guys' names. This guy is Emily Her Herbies. I wish I had some food for a raw cod and one carrot. Well, buddy, I don't have any of that sort of loot for you, so uh, unfortunately, can't help you. And there was also another guy. What's your name? I, I want to know who, who I slept the night with. Elizabeth Knutson. Have you seen any food around here? No, I did not. Either way, we did sleep with them for a little bit, and now we are finally ready to head out. Beautiful. We're gonna go back the way we came from. Look at that. That guy, he, he is just waiting for me. Yeah, there we go. Sit down. We're gonna go back. Oh, whoa. Where did this guy... What the... What happened here? Oh, did he really have a an actual... Did he really use a... Um, a tombstone? Not a tombstone, but um, the undying totem. Did he really use that? I never knew NPCs could use that. That's insane. Get this guy. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That's good. We're gonna go into the metro. I believe this is the metro. Yes, this is a station that goes deep inside the metro. Through that, I hope that I can actually travel a good bit of distance. And, uh get myself maybe to a new place, maybe a different biome. Oh, we have some NPCs here. Can I shoot them through the holes? Let me check. Yes, I can. Let's go. I think we have one more. Yeah, we do. Oh, even one more flying thing. Or right, is that it? Are we good? Good, 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 good. Anything else? Oh yeah, we do have one more here. I am loving this rifle. It is so nice. I can just do this. Just two shots is all it takes, and then uh, and then the guys are are over. So let's just get this guy. Oh, it's a one shot for the little guys. Let's go. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go this way. Yep. Oh, I think we went a little bit too high. Okay, so we are on the top of the building. So where are we? Let me see. We are... I believe we are maybe going out of the city already, so that's good. Can we actually defeat this guy? With, uh, how many hits does it take with a sword? The sword does 8 attack damage. You know what, guys? Maybe I should upgrade my, upgrade my loot a little bit. Oh, and we also have a chest here, which is nice. Let's do, get this, guys. Hit me. Hit me. Oh, the sword is actually not that bad. Oh, it's pretty good. It is pretty good. Nice. On breaking 3, Iron Twin Blade. Hold the phone. 6 attack damage. Curse of Vanishing. 2 attack speed. Uh, no, but the... But the helmet, though, let me see, four armor versus three armor, but on breaking three, knockback resistance. Should I, guys, wear the diamond piece? I'm just gonna put it on for now, see how it looks like. Am I looking better? 
I think I am. I think it's okay. It's okay with me. Either way, let's, uh, before nighttime hits again, let's uh, just make our way somehow over to this place here. Oh, I need to eat up a little bit because I think I'm lo losing a little bit of uh, health. And I have to be really careful ar around my health. We have a rhino. Wait, are rhinos dangerous? Is he gonna attack me? No, no. It, it seems he will not attack me. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. I was very wrong. We have a lot of fishies also, and my flashlight is uh, is uh, working, so that's good. Hold up. What is this place? Okay, okay. Oh, wait. Hold up. I'm friendly. No, don't touch me. Okay, you know what, guys? I think I'm gonna get my flashlight into my other hand. Gonna whip out my weapon, and we're gonna... We're not gonna hunt the... <laughs> the rhinos for their horns. No, we're, we, we don't roll that way. But... This place... Seems a little bit more interesting. So it seems we did stumble upon some sort of... Uh, oh, have a zombie here. Oh, one more. Whisperer fire. Wait, was that a player? What was that thing? Okay, you know what? Either way, we need to maybe get up here somehow oh whoa so it is a seclusion zone you know what guys i think i think i'm gonna turn off my flashlight just for this uh, sake because maybe maybe this place is not filled with uh, friendly people as we as we hope it is okay let me see what can we see from here it's weird the way these lights flash i've never saw that before Oh, we, we can see campfires from this direction. Okay, you know what? We're gonna go through this. Okay, now we now we have to do a, a little bit of parkour. There we go. We are in. Hello? Anyone in here? What is this place? Leave! Leave! There's a chest and a barricaded... Oh, oh, no, no. Careful, careful, careful. I need to eat a little bit. We did also get a chest. We can't see that the zombies are being destroyed in like barbed wire and stuff like that. Oh, am I? Yeah, I, I got a little poison. Oh, oh, damn, damn, no, 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 break this, break this. Can I break it? Please, please, please. Whoa, whoa, oh, damn, what is going on here? Come on, I, uh, I, I am not that bad at the game. It's, uh, it has a high range. Like, you can't really walk even through this one block without getting hit. Hold the phone, it blew up. What happened? Guys, do you see that? That's, uh, that's insane. Oh, whoa, what is that? Okay, that's a zombie. Okay, that's a zombie. Leaf, it did say leaf, and the chest blew up. Okay, you know what? This place is giving me the creeps. It is not as, uh, it does not look like a friendly place. Oh, there's even spores growing all over the place. Okay, I need to really carefully navigate through the barbed wire, which is absolutely everywhere here. Let's open the door. Will these things poison me? Do they go downwards? I really do, don't want to uh, find that out. Okay, um, we can either go down or up. We're gonna go up. Oh! Oh! Quick shooting! Oh no, I think I got poisoned. Yep. Oh uh, yeah, the miscellaneous infection 3. Okay, good. I'm not, not long. Oh! 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 Somewhere up here also? A anyone else? Okay, okay, I think I'm good for now. Damn, this is, uh, this place is giving me the creeps. Empty chest. Empty chest. As well, empty. Was someone here already? And this one? We can use the old combination that we, that we remember. It's like, oh, let's go! They're using the same passcode for every chest. Okay, that's... That makes it a lot easier. We can see that we did get some some loot, but it's 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 okay. We can actually upgrade our loot here in this crafting bench. So we have living leggings. And if I get myself also an enhanced chest plate, I can just free up some space. I'm not really sure how to craft it. I can just type here living. And then maybe we can get this chest plate. So I have the flesh piece, but I don't have the plated. And this is how you craft the plated chest plate. <laughs> it's good that I have a lot of uh, materials from the undead. Now I just combine them both. Yep, there we go. Oh, you even get a little, a little stat. Holding shift activates wall climbing ability. Oh, wow. 
That's really nice. That's really nice. Six armor or ten armor. Ooh, let's go ten, of course. Wait, did my other living leggings run away or was it them? Okay, you know what? Either way, we're gonna we're gonna maybe place this here like that and uh, kind of forget about it. Cooling element. Don't need this nor this nor the nerves. Okay, let me see. Let's reload the weapon. We have some dark blood, but also I did notice that there's this thing here. What was that? That was like a worm. Either way, let's get back to the chest. We should. We should be able to pick up a lot of stuff. Crabber. This is like a weapon. That's nice. We can definitely check it out. Some ammunition, a gyrocopter, and also a fire link, whatever that is. Oh! Oh! It's the weapon! Oh, whoa, it's a sniper. Okay. You know what? This place, it's nice. I like this one. Oh, can't, can't go up here. <laughs> Let's just break a window. Holy, this is nice. This is nice. This is very nice. Oh, someone's in, th in this house. Hello, NPCs. What, what do you require? Because I can probably give you something and we can become friends. So we have Nicholas. Do you have any food? One cooked cod? Three glowberries. Wait, what are glowberries? I don't think I've ever seen glowberries before. Okay, um, and what do you require? You require two cooked rabbits and five cooked cod. Do you have anything in the chest that I can borrow? No, unfortunately not. Okay, uh, that's the place that we came from this evening. Uh, well, last night that we were raiding, sort of. During the day, it does look a little bit more, um, normal, you could say. Oh, we even have a scope, which is uh, pretty neat. And it does have super long range. If this actually shoots that long away, that's going to be amazing. Look at that. It's so nice. Okay, yeah, this weapon, it's insane. And also, I, I assume that I do have um, heavy ammunition. Oh, whoa, I have, I have a lot of heavy. Oh, no, crabber ammunition takes crabber ammunition, I see. Okay, okay. Still, still good, still good. We have a lot of ammunition. Uh, the sniper is like maybe lacking in ammunition, but it's a very powerful weapon. 140 damage. What? I don't even know if a boss ex a boss exists that I can try this weapon on, because the, the shotgun. Oh, the shotgun is already super good, and I have two of those even. <laughs> but yeah, um, that place, that place was pretty cool. Oh, finally a different biome. You know what, guys? Maybe I'm gonna fly my new gyrocopter on this uh, on this terrain here. This is how it looks like. Are we ready to go in? I think we are. Let's go. Keep on pushing. I'm pushing as hard as I can. Go. Minimum rotor speed reached. Ready for takeoff. Okay, you know what, guys? This is pretty epic. I'm really enjoying it. Uh, the flying uh, vehicles in the mod pack. They really add to traversing. And also the heli, because it is a helicopter, means I can probably stop in place. Yes! Okay, this is amazing. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, and there we go. We do have a lot of infected here, but we are looking for just special grade kind of ventures because uh, that's, those are the places that have a lot of loot. Oh, haven't seen this in a very long time, guys. This is what, what it's called a pyromancer tree. Although, there is <laughs> an ex-pyromancer. And look at that. Speaking of, there's also a zombie here. Okay, um, it seems this place, even this holy kind of grail site, I don't know, was affected by the infection, which is pretty unfortunate. And I am nearly uh, full-on armored up with... Uh, with uh, living, living armor, apart from Avalon's boots, which which I think maybe they're better. Four armor versus five armor. Oh yeah, Avalon's boots are actually better. That's nice. That's good to know. Either either way, we are going across the ocean, kind of maybe in the direction of uh, where the base is. But I did fly here and walk here for a long time, so it will take a little bit of time. What is that thing? Getting attacked by it. Wait, it hold. Underground? No, you have to come out. Wait, what, what's going on? What's going on? There's like particles here. Oh, is this it? Is this the thing? Oh, I think I'm poisoned in the air. The air is poisonous now? Damn, what is going on here? Oh, and I'm losing a lot of health. Oh, and we can see a lot of mobs. Oh, he's spawning in mobs. 
Okay, okay. Oh, damn. This is getting pretty dangerous. What's going on here? It seems I found some... Oh, what is this? What is going on here? Okay, okay. Run, 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 run. What is going on here, bro? This is insane. This is pretty insane. Okay, you know what, guys? We're gonna put, um, some... Some... Some, some of this? Like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like this. Like this. One more here. Okay, okay. Now I need to get my, uh, what is it called? My flamethrower out. Yeah, flamethrower out now. Let's go. Mama, mama cream. Do you have mama cream or is it in my backpack? Let's get these guys. Get these guys. Get this guy. Okay. Okay, um, this, this seems a lot better. But my FPS is a little bit down. I think those things are causing it. What is that thing? You guys see that all the way from here? It's insane. It's like disgusting even. Okay, you know what? I think I need to get my ammunition out for this one. The, oh, they just keep spawning, spotting in, huh? Yeah, like this. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Just go up. That's all I need to do. I just need to go up. Oh, there we go. We are up. What is going on there? I think they were chasing someone. Wait, can I look at them from here? Yes, I can. What were they chasing? And these things things just keep on spawning in. Okay, I'm going to try and take out one of these nasty things. How did it go? Not so good. One more shot. Holy. It's 140 or something damage per shot, guys. Yes, 140 damage. FYI, for your interest, guys, the regular sword does like i don't know but it doesn't do a lot holy okay this is uh pretty insane and i have three of those guys oh and there are also bodies here okay i'm gonna try and uh, get this guy Whoa, that's a third shot fourth fifth no sixth if i just keep on shooting that thing maybe it will go down is uh, maybe there's a damage reduction over distance effect? I'm not really sure. Okay, you know what, guys? I think I need to go all the way down there if I if I want to maybe hit that guy a couple of times because this is uh, this is not working out at all. I'm gonna run for it. I'm gonna run for it. Now I'm gonna do this. Use the cream. There we go. Now run, run again. Oh, but don't hit the spores because they will. They will, uh, poison me. Okay, do this, do this. Oh, damn, okay, yep, they poisoned me good. They, oh, they got me good. What is that thing? Oh, what the hell is that thing? No, no, dude, no, no, no. I am not ready to go out like this. Maybe I will leave this place. Maybe I will. But I will set fire to these things. I will do this. Oh, this is insane. There is an airplane I can, I can use. But I think I'm just gonna maybe run by feet for for my life because uh if they catch me in the plane that's gonna be gg that's gonna be a gg for me bro okay wait why do i not have any more magma creams did i run out of magma creams oh yeah i did okay that's not good the flamethrower is out it does not have any more ammunition guys i will go here hide here they can't they can't come here right they can't right oh good 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 okay this oh no they can break it. No, run. Run, 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 run. If I just keep on shooting maybe this final guy, then I can get rid of the horde. Oh, yeah, it blew you up. There we go. Good, good, good. Okay, so I think that's... Oh, okay, yep. There are flying things going after me now. I, I need to leave a little bit. This is insane. There's too many of them. You guys see this? No! No! No, I fell. No, I. You can't reload. You can't reload. Oh no 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 no. Where is it? Where is it? I have one heart. I have one heart. Did you have anything good? No. Did you? No. Put out the fire. Put out the fire. Go 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 go. Um, is there really no good loot here? Okay, you know what? At least I can get all of the XP from here. I think these guys dropped a lot of XP. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, that thing is still over there, crawling, waiting. I'm not even sure what that thing is. Is it, like, even friendly, or is it super... Oh, the hordes are getting super big. The hordes are getting super big. I mean, very, very big. Too big for, uh, for me to handle, in fact. Okay, 
Um, what, what do I do, guys? I need to get out from here somehow, but I'm not sure how. Um, oh, we got a brand new horde over there. We have a new horde under me. And we also have, uh, yeah, an even bigger horde over there. Okay, you know what, guys? I think I'll just go into the, into the ocean. You know what? I think it's about time that we fly. We're gonna try flying, guys. Let's go, baby. We can do this. Woo! Let's go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. No, no. Go, fly. Fly. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, oh. Okay. Good. Good, guys. Good, good, good. Look at this. Look at this. It's throwing something at me, bro. It's even throwing something at us, guys. Okay, you know what? Good. We are out of here. We need to leave this place ASAP. So this world can be pretty darn dangerous if you're... No! No! I need to stun music weapons. Was that my final flight? Okay, I, 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 I no longer have a, a vehicle. I need to find my airplane, or at least my gyroplane. Wait, did I not pick one up? Like, one more? There was one more on the ground, I swear, but... I didn't pick it up. Oh, oh, here it is. Saved. Saved, guys. We're, we're good. Let's get in. Oh, and it's even flying R right away. Oh, okay, that was way too close. That was way too close. Okay, no reloading weapons for me while I'm flying. That I need to get that through my head. I need to understand that. The, the sooner, the better, guys. We did find a little village and also a train station of some sort beside here. We can maybe land here or we can just continue actually. Now uh, this place, if they trade a little bit of emeralds, I can get maybe some obsidian from them and stuff stuff like that. That that would be uh, pretty, pretty useful. Because I am planning on going into the nether just to check out if that place is uh, also infected. What's this? The Eye of the Vigil. Oh, I really... I really don't know if I should use this thing. The Eye of the Vigil. Guys, is this like... Is this gonna endgame me? I'm scared to right-click it. Oh! The Eye of the Vigil! How long is the effect for? Oh, I'm not sure, but look at that. I can... I can see the infected. Holy, okay. Okay, um, so this place is safe, it seems. That's nice. That's good to know. But there are infected under me. And there's quite a bit of them. <laughs> you know what? This is this is nice, but um, if I relog, will the effects stay? Well, either way, we're gonna find out soon enough. You don't trade, you trade emeralds. I need obsidian, baby. I'm ready to trade anything for that obsidian. No, you don't trade either. We have Tarak Code, which is a beautiful, beautiful uh, <laughs> uh, block. But yeah, these guys, they don't trade, it seems. But there are a lot of cats here. Okay, you know what? If they don't trade it, I'm gonna get it myself. Oh, and the effect disappeared. We can no longer see enemies underground. Uh, it was good while it lasted, I guess. Now, what way should I go? Maybe I'll go this way. Maybe, maybe I'll go this. Nope. <laughs> um, I am looking for more, maybe, diamonds in the cave systems. And the caves don't have a lot of um, enemies, which is also... A, l a little plus, that's like a little win. I take little wins these days, guys. If I can just win a little bit, I'm I'm really pleased and I'm I'm just happy with how everything is. I don't think we went here. Oh, I think we're going in circles. Speaking of going in circles, here we did find a little bit of diamonds. We have one, two, we have two diamonds. Any more? Or is this it? The caving system? In this modded mod pack for the newest version of Minecraft, guys. Oh, did I see one more? I think I did. Yes, I did. Let's go. The cave system, it's insane. Back, back in my day, guys, we never had cool stuff like this. We never had cool caves, which went endlessly underground. <laughs> it's just uh, such a cool experience. Look, well, how deep can we go, guys? How deep? How deep does it go? And you can probably eat this thing. Can you? Let's. You want? You guys? You guys want to? Nope. Never mind. We can't test it out because uh, it doesn't fall off. No, we can't eat it. Oh, even more diamonds. Even more diamonds. One. Is this it? Oh, that's it. That's unfortunate. 
That is not very- Oh, that's a witch. How did she get so close? <laughs> we got the witch. Oh, she dropped a potion. A potion of let me see what. What do we get? We can throw out- Hmm. I don't have a lot of stuff that I can throw out, but I can try and maybe do this. Is this going to be better? I think it is. A potion of speed. Oh, let's go. We can- Oh, one more diamond. Let's go. Let's get the speed potion. Let's get the speed potion. Let's go. And let's get the diamonds as well. Never mind. That works. Oh. Where are you guys coming from? Is there a spawner nearby? Because, uh... The caves should be a little bit... Oh. We have one more. But the caves should be, um, empty. They should be, uh... They should be nice and safe for me, but, um... What's going on here? Oh, even more diamonds. I'm telling you guys, it's insane how easy it is to find diamonds. Like, if you're if you're going down to a certain level in the caves, then you just start exploring, and you can easily get, like, a stack of diamonds. It's insane. Well, not if you go to a complete dead end, that is. Then you have to make your way back. And here we have a spawner. Let me see, will the spawner spawn? Or we can destroy it for that XP. Let's get the XP. The chest has a saddle, which I will take. I will take the saddle. Okay, you know what? I think we've done maybe enough mining for today. I can see the shore. Ooh. Ah. Ah, here we are. We're finally out. Okay, um. That's, uh. That's very, very, very big caves. Like, those are some huge cave systems. Okay, you know what, guys? I'm gonna hop on my airplane. Why is it so dark? Is it supposed to be this dark? There are no stars here. That's insane. Okay, get this zombie. Oh, I see why there are no stars. It's gonna rain soon. Oh, and there's lightning. Oh, and they're fighting each other. It seems they're not friendly. Okay, you know what? Let's head on out from here. Lissaloda Alexanderson. What do you want? Look like, looks like you don't understand my request. You didn't even sell me it yet. Five glow berries, three pumpkin pies. And then what? Will these guys become my friends and uh, protect me and be my uh, companions? I could perhaps get a few companions. It would be pretty cool. But let me see. We do have some froggies. <laughs> imagine a big one like that, like this one. And imagine if it'd be infected. That'd be even worse. Okay, you know what? You're too far away from my base, and I think there's like only one of you in this building. So I'm not gonna collect the materials necessary for you and your house. I will uh, maybe find my other companions. Other companions might be more suitable because they will be closer to my base. And that will just make things easier, I guess. Already getting stormed by these guys. Need to make my way out of here somehow. Okay, um, let me see. I will maybe use my, use my, um, repeater a lot more these days. Okay, so let's get this guy. Get this guy so he wouldn't follow us. We have some zombies. Go. Get this one. This one. This one. Okay, I have a, I have a lot of ammunition. But I, oh, oh. I think that's a survivor spawned in. Infected one at least. Azami, his name was. Okay, let me see. We are making our way out of the city, which is good. But the zombies, they just keep spawning, spawning in. Oh, look at this. It's like my shots aren't even hitting them. There we go. That's better. That's better. The little one. I don't like the little ones because they, they're, they're scary. Extra scary. And we are trying to maybe find the faction that the, that the note was speaking of like on day one. The faction base shouldn't be randomly spotted. It should be somewhere, but I should find clues on how to get there. But I feel like I'm going in a completely wrong direction. Guys, if uh, if I still didn't find nothing, perhaps, perhaps I should go and do the complete opposite of what I do on the regular. Maybe that way I can get some clues. Oh, oh, we found another one. Two? No, no, just one. Okay, so we found the boss. Oh, he's shooting at me. Yeah, he is. So he's shooting at me some pellets. Oh, but he's missing. I think I can take him, guys. I think I can take him. But I will take him maybe from like, um, let me see. 
a high advantage point, maybe like somewhere around here, like this. Yep, like this, sort of. Let's break this. Ah, go, go, no, before the zombie gets me. Before the zombie gets me. No, let's get the shotgun out. So where is that guy? Okay, we can see that um, a flying thing is right here. Let's reload the shotgun. How many, how many more shots does this guy take? My health is so low. Oh, there we go. I got him. I got him. Okay, you know what? Time to maybe regenerate. Oh, look at that. Spore. I think I got I, I got an achievement for something, but I'm not sure for what. Okay, so where is that boss guy? I know that he's somewhere here. Is he below me? No, he's not below me. He was right here, right guys? Did he leave? Or is he like walking around the building or something? He must be. Because I know that the them guys, they don't they don't despawn easily, that's for sure. Oh, there he is. There he is. Okay, so let's do this. Reload reload the Kraber. Shoot him shoot him again. Oh, is he gonna is, can he destroy blocks? I think he can Oh damn he can. Spraying and praying. Reload the weapon. Reload it. Okay, I think. No way, is that it? He was that easy? Are you serious? There's no way he was that easy. I thought that was like a super OP boss. I never expected him to be like so easy going. I thought that it would take a lot more. Hold up. So he took one Kraber or maybe like a couple of Krabers and then Carbine. I see. Then he took the Carbine to the face. To the face. That's interesting. That's good to know. Well... Oh wow, the sniper is like pretty bad. I can't even hit a single zombie with it. And it's not a one-shot weapon for uh, the boss. But I like it either way. Plus you can zoom in. Like really, really zoom in. Oh, something is happening with the weather. Uh, maybe it's rain, maybe it's not rain. Either way, I think we need to get ourselves a landing strip. And uh, get back into the air. In this here chest, we have a lot of iron, but maybe not enough of uh, good materials. We also did get a Firelink Sword, which I did inspect it, guys, and it does actually uh, have, like, a pretty good use. We can teleport with it. Well, we can, first of all, hit zombies with it. That's right, hit the zombie. Hit the zombie. But we can use the Firelink to right-click on a, um, a campfire and then teleport back to it. Sort of like a bonfire. From uh, from other video games, but it's uh, it's it's good. It's interesting. I will definitely make use of it, and maybe I can even mark my base like it. But right now, currently, I am maybe looking for more sort of um, dangerous, <laughs> more, more, more dangerous endeavors. Oh oh, speaking of, we have. Uh, oh, damn. Oh, holy. No, go back, go back, go back. No, no, no. Go down, go down. Okay, you know what, guys? Get in the plane, bro. Get in the plane now and let's start it. That guy is throwing stuff at me and he is literally, practically hitting me. Is that another boss? Is that... Wait, hold up. Don't tell me them guys spawn in now normally. Like, don't tell me that's normal for them to spawn in. Okay, I'm gonna try and maybe um, attack him with fire. Without really um, destroying uh, the village beside me, because that that wouldn't be smart. Hopefully that guy won't hit me even once. Okay, we got him on fire. I need to eat a little bit. I do have some cooked pork chops. Let's go. Okay, let's go. No, I failed miserably. Oh damn, that is not good. Can I equip a torch here? Yes, I can. Good, good. Get this zombie. I think there was another one. Yeah, yeah, there he is. Oh, 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 no. Leave, run, 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 run. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, what is that thing? No, this is, uh, why, 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 I did not expect that guy to attack me through, through the tunnels. Oh, he's still on top of me, bro. He is still here. He is still here. Okay, am I good this way? Am I good this way? Whoa, that gave me such a shock. It's insane. I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't expect him to attack me like through the glass or something. Look at him go. He's following me. 
Leave me alone. No, leave me be. <laughs> well, what is he doing? He's like following me and stuff. No, no, no. Okay, um, let me see. I should be careful not to hit, um, let me see, um, any glass. Because if I hit the glass, then he maybe will come in. Is he still following me? Yes, he is. He can't attack me, right? I don't think he can. No, he can't. How many heads? One head. Two head. Three, four, five, six. I, I count at least eight heads on this guy. That's a monster. And he's also, um... A water-based monster, it seems. Now, maybe I can get, like, one hole? How is, how is he still damaging me? Wait, is he not taking any dam- Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Hold the phone. Hold the phone. I might have to eat a golden apple in this case. Okay, yeah, good, 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 good. Yep, you can stay here. I'm playing it very dangerous. And I'm gonna open up another, another hidey hole that I can shoot you from. So let me just uh, rejuvenate myself even more. Let's do this. Okay, maybe I could set up some um, munitions to get the guy, but maybe I can ju just shoot him with uh, through the window. Okay, let's let's try it out. Okay, there he is. Oh, we got him! We got him! Yes, yes. Let's go. Let's let's get out of. Let's get out. Let's get out. Go 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 go. Are we close to the shore? Yes, we are. Okay, good. That's uh, one less scary monster. You know what, guys? Maybe it's be better if I just run in the tunnel like this. Yeah, definitely. I think this is going to be a little bit better if I just do this. Okay, uh, the tunnels are now... I know that they are my, <laughs> my ally. Because through the tunnels, I can fight any monster, any beast. And uh, make it out alive, pretty much. But yeah, it is, uh, it is getting a little bit dangerous. Maybe I should go back to my base and uh, fix it up a little bit. Because I haven't been there in forever. Oh! This thing just popped out from nowhere. Oh, damn. Get this guy. Reload, reload, reloading the shotgun. Oh, no. Run, 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 run. Oh, there we go. We got him. I think there's an infection around my base. Because I'm pretty sure I'm very... Yeah, it's definitely an infection. It's growing rapidly. Now, what's the cause of the infection? There should be a culprit here. Uh, from who or what shall not be named. This thing is... Uh, spr oh, okay. Okay, it's sprouting from... Oh, damn. Okay, okay. okay. Um, have to be a little bit more careful. If I'm being honest. Just a little bit more careful. Can I, um, can I maybe remove a tree here? Okay, okay. I, I did manage to uh, get myself a campfire fire for my base, kind of my home, home spot. But um, there is a little problem. We have an inf infestation of spores, uh, which means that my base will be spored up soon. Is that what it means? Oh, I think the whole place is getting spored up. Oh, that is not good. Oh, yeah, definitely. Look at this, guys. The spore virus is eating away at everything. Now, is there a way that I can stop it from um, getting to my base? Huh, that's 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 interesting. But yeah, um, the diseases uh, that is causing every zombie to turn mindlessly undead and dangerous is uh, it's not looking too good for me. Oh, also, the tree did manage to uh, grow here. Let's put another tree here. Why are my doors open? Is that normal, guys? Are my doors supposed to be open? I don't think they should be. Um, well, anyway, let's carefully navigate this place. Do this. Now we can just do this. And my door broke. <laughs> yes, yeah, something definitely did happen. Wait, did I get another door? What's this? What is this? How, how many doors do I get? Wait, did I just duplicate the doors? Guys, you saw it here first. This is how you du duplicate doors. <laughs> you saw it here first. I got two extra doors. Let's go. I have no clue why I even need them, but I guess I can place them like that. <laughs> Third, three, three door uh, penetration. There is no way uh, that's gonna gonna be. Uh... Oh, oh! Can't be spawning in inside of my base. Let me get my um, fire link. Let's set it. Oh, yes, that's it. 
This is our home. Our sweet, sweet home. <laughs> I feel better already. Now I can always teleport back. Munition system. Now this is pretty interesting. I could place it around my base as extra protection. Oh, and there is no way for me to exit, by the way. <laughs> I need to exit through like a, li a, a little hidey hole or from the very top floor. Early morning, guys. Early morning, and that is a perfect time to find out where this spore invasion is coming from. The spore invasion is dangerous if you don't stop it. If you do stop it, then it's no longer dangerous. But to stop it, we need to find the culprit. So we can see that the invasion kind of is uh, got up to this point, sort of, but it's gonna continue going. So at the very moment, it's on this line right here. My base is around there. That's my base. So it will... Oh, look at that. We have one already growing here. It will continue rapidly increasing and going up to my base. Oh, look at this. It's gotten up to this far already. Oh, even further. Okay. Okay. I re... Where did you come from? I really need to eradicate the spore, spore invasion because... Oh, oh, got quite a bit of zombies. Because... If we don't, then my base is as good as gone. And what 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 is a good of a base if it doesn't protect me from these monsters here? Okay, I'm gonna get this guy. They are pretty darn strong, not gonna lie. Reload, reload. There we go. Who else? Who else wants a little bit? I know you guys want a little bit of me. Don't worry, I've got enough. Let's reload another double barrel shotgun just in case. Oh yeah, this is some nasty stuff. How many more are there come? Where are they coming from? Oh, we have even a fly guy. Get this guy. I think I have to use my repeater a lot more. Oh, they even shot arrows at me. That's that's not looking too good. Maybe you guys can't really see them, but there are many, many. Inf One even fell. Oh, maybe it's this building. Okay, l let me an analyze the situation. Spores go like this, and then they stop here, and then they continue going like this, and they sort of... Oh yeah, they go all the way down there. We can see it from here. Uh, we, we can see a spore right where I'm aiming at. So that means maybe he's in this building. The main... Oh. Oh, you can walk in and see some of them, but not all of them, it seems. Let's try and jump in. Get in the window. What is this thing? Okay, we're good. We're good for now. Oh, there's so many of these things. Okay, I'm gonna re- uh, get, some, get my health up. Anyone here? Yes, there is. Oh, and he is shooting at me. The pillager is down, but that is not the main guy. I can see that this building is very, very much so infected. Are they shooting through the windows? Okay, someone or something is definitely breaking the windows. Okay, nothing on the bottom floor. No, nothing on the bottom floor. Oh, 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 what was that? What was that? I think I picked up, um, iron chest plate, don't need that. Oh, I can see someone still, wa oh! Someone threw a potion at me. Okay, let's uh, let's get the double barrel. Let's go. I'm ready. Reload the weapons. Reload all of the weapons. Okay, uh, we're getting. Oh, I can. Oh yeah, here he is. That's the main guy. Oh, we got him. We got him. We got him. Oh, they're still throwing potions from down below. That's crazy. Okay, um. Let me see. Was that the main um, guy for the spore invasion? Is this it that I eradicated? What if I what if I just remove it? Does, does that mean I'm good or does oh I'm getting pulled in? Some zombies are uh, somewhere. So I oh damn! Not into the cobweb, bro. No, not the cobweb. Leave me alone. Okay. Holy, that building is completely overtaken. We're gonna try and jump it. Yes, we can. Good. Now let's clear a pathway. Holy guys, do you see this invasion? And it's right beside my base. Now I'm not sure if I should remove it by hand, or it's just gonna stop by itself. 
Either way, it is pretty dangerous out here, so you should always be careful. Let's do this, do this. Oh no, there's like a whole side of this building taken over by the by the spongy virus. That's not good. That is not good at all. I think I need to jump it like this. Oh, 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 damn. Something pulled me in. A bad mob. This one. Get this guy, get this guy. There we go. Does he have a friend? Is that it? Okay, I think we eradicated the, th the threat for now. <laughs> one here. Another one here. One more over here. Oh, we have a chest here. Come on, let's... Oh! Oh, did one already get activated? Oh, damn, okay, um... Get on top of the building. Let's go. C can we do this? We should be able to... Oh, oh damn. Got this guy. Oh, the munition system did fi... Not me, bro. Oh, okay, yep, not me, not me. Good, 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 good. Oh, damn. Not me, for now. Holy... This this is a battlefield. It really is. Oh, no. How, how did it happen so quickly? Wait, did the munition system that I place... Attack literally everything that it possibly can. Oh Look at that. It's still on fire. Hopefully. It's not gonna blow right in front of me, but maybe uh, It doesn't work on uh, these guys for some reason Get this guy this guy Clear out the fire just a little bit. Oh, we have one more one more. Oh, oh plenty more plenty more Okay, I don't think I can probably go in there Oh, we have another, another walker. Unfortunate. Oh, okay. Someone. Oh, someone was th in that building, but I'm too scared to um go near <laughs> the munition systems because they kind of attack enemies. But if there's an enemy nearby me, then that's uh that's an. Oh, oh, yep. Speaking of, speaking of. Okay. Um, is my health gonna re regenerate? Am I good? Okay, I should be good. Okay, so it seems that uh, the munition systems are working, but there's just so many of these bad guys that it's, uh, it's turning out to be um, pretty difficult. Let's actually go all the way up here and uh, get more of a higher level on, uh, on the surrounding area. We can see that we have an anvil here, which is uh, maybe, maybe I should take it. Uh, how's the spore invasion going? We can see the spore invasion kind of stopped in its tracks and the main cul culprit was in that building. We did eradicate him, but the building nearby is, uh, oh, it's crazy. Oh, it's crazy gone. Them flying guys coming out from nowhere. Oh, there we go. Got him. Got him. Got him. Them flying guys coming out from nowhere. Oh, damn. Oh, saved. Saved. Look at that witch. Wait, you didn't activate the munition thing? How? Why did you not activate it? You should... Oh, oh. Get this guy on fire. Get this guy. We have one more flying uh, guy there. Okay, let's uh, just go back up a level. Let's go back up a level. How am I supposed to get my base without being, like, blown up and stuff like that? Let's try this. Yeah, this seems good. This seems good. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, so now I'm at the very tippy top of my base, and I feel pretty... Pretty... Oh, oh. I don't feel good at all, though. No. Go in, go in. Go in and lock the doors. It's not safe. It is not safe at all. <laughs> the flying things are trying to take over. Okay, um, let me see. I have so, so little health. Maybe I will eat a golden apple. Yeah, there we go. That's better. That's better. Okay, I think I'm just gonna have to... S How can I sleep tonight, huh? Them guys spawning in here. And it's lightning. Either way, I think we're gonna have to end the night here because there are quite a bit of zombies. We are getting ravaged this night and the munition systems are working and they're eradicating the threat, but I still don't feel super safe. We came here for one thing and one thing only and that is not a chest. No, it is not the chest, but the chest still it's it's good. Oh, a golden apple. Let's go. Clock, flint, and steel. We will take one, just in case we need it. And we are here actually for obsidian. 
Let's get the obsidian, baby, let's go. We're going to the nether, but the nether portal, we will build it, actually, in my base. That's right. There we go, ice bucket challenge, let's go. That's my first obsidian. We need plenty more obsidian to go. In fact, maybe I will have to create some of my own. And I think it would be easier to actually do the speedrunner's way of getting um, the actual nether portal. But this is still fine either way. We can get the nether portal up and running. And we can head into the nether. Hopefully, the nether will not have them super, super infected. But something is telling me that the nether might be a tiny little bit off worse than the overworld. Overworld, I think we've, we are lucky that we just have a uh, zombie invasion here. Because... The nether is always a little bit more dangerous. Instead of running, we can actually use uh, the fire link. So let's try. Does this thing work actually, or is it does it not work? Are you are you ready, guys? It's uh, now or never. Let's go. Oh, oh, oh! It did work. We're back at we're back at the base. Let's go. Let's go, this is amazing, this is so amazing. Now I can quickly build the obsidian portal and we can quickly head out. And uh, hope for the best, hopefully. The portal, um, maybe I'll build it around this Serbia, like that, yep. It's gonna, it's gonna be like this. You might be questioning, what? That's like weird looking, what, what, what are you building? You'll see, you'll see guys, look at this. Now ain't this a beauty? Completely, by the way, um, inside of a wall but let's go that's that's how quickly you can go to the nether now before i go to the nether i think i have to maybe craft a little bit more weapons i was choosing what weapon i should go with seeing as i did lose my um infected saber i was going for maybe uh something a little bit more spicy you could say infected great sword infected armands in fact, the combat shovel sounds pretty interesting. Or infected spear. Maybe I will go with a great sword. Now we are missing quite a bit of everything for this one. Uh, maybe, maybe this axe then. Fleshy bone and fleshy claw. Let me see. Let me see. Fle we have 15 fleshy claws and we have mutated fiber. What can we make with that? Well, we can definitely make a living core from all of these ingredients, so uh, that's a must. We must get this. Now, in, hmm, rapier or scythe? I already have a bow infected maul, definitely not. You know what, I really dig, um, I really dig the big axe. For this one, we need bones, and bones is something we don't have because we don't actually hunt skeletons, so I think that's a little problem. You know what? Well, either way, while we're here, we can at least uh, put a tombstone here to look a little bit more lively. In fact, oh no, can't break this. No, no, no. Maybe let's put the tombstone somewhere around the front area or here. You know what? Maybe this is going to be a little bit more safer. Look at that. Now the zombie snow. Don't walk past, or you will be ending up in a casket, or something like something of that sort. You never know. Either way, I can I can commemorate something or someone with this being in my base. Now I do sleep on the other side, of course, so uh, it's a good distance away from me. But in commemoration, in commemoration of let me see, my front yard. Yep, my front yard. It's it's been ravaged by the zombies. It's a battlefield out there. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Am I? I think I am. We need to go deeper. Come at me. I'm ready for anyone and any anything. Okay, I think I'm safe. We're safe for now. Maybe I should get my gyrocopter out for this one, for this expedition. Just to maybe get more ground covered in this, uh, in this domain. Oh, we stumbled upon something. Most definitely. What is this? This seems like a piglin base. Oh, there's a big mosquito after me. No. No, please don't. Don't suck in my face. Don't leave me alone. I'm a friendly guy, I guess, in a stuck in a zombie apocalypse. I'm trying to find some bases, some factions. There should be... Oh, oh two, two mosquitoes after me. Bro, that's not good. Okay, let me see. Will the piglins... Oh, yeah, the piglins do not like me. 
They oh he's on my face. Get the sh there we go. N Nightmare if you oh no. Okay, um get the golden apple. Okay, that's the golden apple. Now we just need to make it out from here. Oh, there we go, we made it. Now we got an achievement. Oh quickly! Get rid of the ball! Let's go! Oh no, 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 I didn't see the lava again, bro! Get the zombie! Uh, get the piglin! Eat the golden apple! That's me and my golden apple's gone now? That's it. Okay, that is not good. That is not good. I messed up big time. I messed up big, big time. Okay, um, we are now stuck. What is this thing? We are now stuck in the... Oh, no. It disappeared into the lava. That's not good. We are stuck in the piglin's domain. We are now in there. In their domain, which is uh, frightening, so to speak. Plus, we are on base level. We should maybe, hopefully, make our way up somehow by climbing the ruins, I guess. The corridors are our endless, but oh, yes! Oh, we found even a chest. Let's go, baby. Let's go, guys. Let's go. We just need to get there somehow. Oh, that's a steep drop. That is a very very steep drop. Let's try and do this, like that. Now let's try and get in safely, like this. Block of gold and a golden axe of arthropods for... Okay, we're gonna try out the arthropods. Maybe it's worth it, guys. Maybe it is. So far, the nether is pretty lackluster, but we are here on special business. And the business is... Well, at least it doesn't involve piglins. I can tell you that. The piglins don't have nothing for me. Get this. Get these guys. Who else? There we go. Got some piglins here. Oh, I'm missing. I'm a pretty bad shot. But these guys, they stand no chance. Okay, we have even more blocks of gold. Crimson nylon. That's interesting, but not what we're looking for. Oh, look at this. We stumble upon a dungeon. Now that's exactly what I need. Look at them. You guys think they're friendly or do you think they hate me? Do you guys think they hate me? I think they do. We can try it out still. You guys, are you cool with me? Are we cool? Yeah, we're cool. Let's go. I'm wearing skin and bones and flesh of zombies from the overworld. I think I'm cool with them now. That's good to know that I'm cool and I don't have to eradicate. Ooh. I don't have to. Er oh, yeah. Okay. I do have to eradicate a little bit of their population, but not a lot. This guy. Yeah. Oh, he's running away. Good. You better run away. Hey, little guy. He's running a chicken. Either way, is this, uh, is this what I'm thinking it is? Or is this something different? Find center square. Oh, okay. Okay, um, I'm pretty sure we can't maybe press these guys. Or maybe we can. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. Get the shotgun out. Come on, come on. Oh, there's so many of them. Oh, move, move, move. Run, 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 run. Oh, damn, that is not good. That is not good. Go, 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 go. Ah, oh, whipping out all of my, all of my weapons that I can. Monster. Oh, there we go. There we go. Get this. Oh, good. You're not going after me. Yeah, you want to choose the axe for the sword? I don't mind, bro. Whatever, whatever you feel like. Okay. Um, let's reload this uh, carbine and the shotgun as well. Okay. Uh, it seems. Oh damn. Oh wait, there's even more spawning in. Okay, I think I need to... Okay, I need to go. I need to leave this place. I need to um, remove their spawner. Quickly, quickly. Go, 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 go. No, no, no. That's one. That's one. Oh. Oh! Okay, okay. So far, so good, guys. So far, so good. Oh, I can probably get on here. Oh, please, 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 please. Get on here, I said. Yeah, get on here. Oh, oh, no, my health. My health is so low. Oh, no, this is uh, this is not good. Okay, I need to eat up a little bit, regen my health, guys. 
This is not looking good. Um, can I can I remove it from here or do I need to get closer? I think I need to get a little bit closer. Yeah, that is not good. I could go down this way if they're not gonna touch me. Okay, um, I can probably. Okay, um. <laughs> oh, please! That's difficult. That's very, very difficult. I can't do nothing around this place. Okay, I can probably remove some piglins and then I can get to mine. Go, 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 go. Go. No, stop moving, guys. Stop moving. Oh! Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Go, 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 Run, 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 run. Okay. We're... Oh, damn. Oh, damn. That is not good. I stole their player head. That's... That's good. At least we won this one. Now you'll know not to mess with me. Yeah, the nether. It's a little bit... It's a little bit um, dangerous. Player head. I'll keep this for my base. Holy... Oh no, oh no, get this guy, get this guy, get, get him, get him, get him, I know he's somewhere here, they're just falling, oh no guys, you see that, oh, do you think they see me, do you think I, I aggroed them, there's no way I aggroed them, right, oh, they just keep on falling, okay, I could probably go and try and attack their tower from here, yes, yes I can, let's go, that's what I call a slick move. They won't even know that I'm here. No, they will not, sir. They will not. And I am accessing their tower. This guy. This guy. The Citadel in the in the mid-game. Like okay. Break this. Okay, let's check out their chests. We have a lot of Ender Pearls. Netherite Ingot! Bro! Netherite Ingot! Holy! That's big! Warp Ender Pearl! Armor! Get away from me. Oh, what is that thing? What is that? That looks like, um... A, a, a frog, I guess? But like a weird one. Okay, Crying Obsidian, Netherite Ingot, another one. Even more. Oh, let's go. We need this. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Feather Falling. You already know. I was waiting for it time to get rid of my old boots. Finally, I got an upgrade. I know it's a little bit, a little bit less armor, guys, but trust me, I believe that um, it's a worth, it's worth swap. Okay, we're gonna go down. Let's get rid of this frog. Maybe I shouldn't have a tiny frog. Oh no, we're good, we're good, we're good. I juke all of the Enderman. They, oh, let's go, Magma Cream. I need this. I need this ASAP. ASAP. Curse of Vanishing. No, we don't need this. Now the right ingot, another one, and a diamond sword. No, we, 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 won't, we won't take the diamond sword. Okay, I think we took pretty much everything from this floor. Going down a few floors. We can't see that there are endermen here, but it doesn't look like they uh, pose any threat. Especially if we, uh, we uh, do this. Yes. Oh! Holy, that was way too close. Okay, don't try and grapple while Enderman, Endermen are going after you, because uh, maybe it won't end as good. Oh yeah, they're like the real weird ones, but we made it, and we're good. Oh, it's getting a little bit dangerous. We did find a portal, but there is a slight little, little, a little problem. I can't find a landing strip, and there are way, way too many piglins. You know what, maybe we're gonna just leave that place. Oh, whoa, this is way too close for comfort. I really much preferred the hy the hydro helicopter, or whatever you call it, because it was a helicopter at the end of the day. And it's just a lot easier to travel with it than traveling with an airplane. The airplane, it's too quick for the nether. And the nether is, like, very difficult to navigate. Like, I have to make circles just to squeeze through little holes like this. And I have no clue where they're going even. This one, for example, I'm gonna slow down my speed. Slow down my speed and I'm gonna land around this area like that. Now I'm gonna increase my speed and I'm gonna fly downwards. Like this is no way to travel the nether guys. This is, there should be an easier way. I want my helicopter back. 
But it is a skill issue, and I'm pretty skilled. Before I, before I leave the nether, I'm just looking for one thing. Bones. If I can get some bones, I can I can leave the nether very quickly. Please, give me some bones. I know they should be somewhere here at least. Somewhere here, definitely. Looking back on my footage, guys, I did notice that I did leave... Um, let me see. Um, I think I'm not a netherite ingot, but an ancient debris. Which, uh, oh yeah, it sucks. It really does suck. I did forget one ancient debris in a chest, but there's no way I'm gonna go back to get it. So, uh, yeah, but we did find something else, which is maybe not as good, but still pretty nice. We can, we can get the bones for fertilizer, because I am struggling a little bit on food. I have to just get some pigs around my base, cook it up, which is, uh, not super time convenient. If I could just get a melon farm going, and I really love melons. I just love melons. Not only in real life, but also in, in game. I like melons in game, because uh, they're very easy to uh, uh, get a farm going for them. Okay, um, I can see more bones over there. Let's try and jump this quickly. I should be a little bit more careful, because I am, at the end of the day, um, Playing it on hardcore, and if something goes uh, mayhem, then that will be the end of me. But hopefully, okay, I know that the wood will burn. I know that that much, guys. Of course, I'm not super noob. I'm not a super noob, but I am. It is a little bit difficult for me to play hardcore mo mode in this mod pack. The other mod packs, I'm like super OP. This one, it's a little bit different. So, uh, there we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. I am... I can play Minecraft a lot better without shaders. I know, guys, that you are typing comments that I should get good. Guys, I'm playing with a shader. Please understand me. If, if I turn off the shader, then it's not gonna be pretty. But I want it to be pretty. And because of the shader, I'm not playing as a super competitive guy. Uh, I did many faction PvP wars back in my day. I can play the game. But I am not super good, of course. I'm not that good. When I get back to my world, my overworld, I also need to get some bones to finally build the sword I always wanted. And we will do just that. You know what, guys? I think we picked up enough. That's not ancient debris. No, that's, that's nether. I think, guys, we picked up enough. I think we're gonna get our sword. Wait, where is it? And we're gonna go back to the base. Okay, that's a uh, one, two, three, go. What? Doesn't work. What? No. What do you mean? Click campfire to your link. Burns arrow and small radius swing. What do you mean, look into your campfire? Is my base gone? What does that mean? What does that mean, guys? Well, wait, hold, hold the phone. Come on, I, I know that I have it linked. I used it before. It's not a one-time thing, that's for sure. There is no way it's a one-time thing, right? Come on, I, I know I can do this. I know I can if I just try hard enough. It's not working. I think I need to leave the nether region and then it will work. Oh, that made things a lot more difficult. I have no clue where that portal is. We're gonna get a lot of this. I think we need quite a bit to get to that region. Get to that portal. I broke the matrix, guys. I broke the matrix. I know how to get back home. I'm not gonna find the other portal that I came from because I didn't write down the coordinates because I didn't think I need to. But I did do one thing. I thought up of an idea. Oh, I could use an ender pearl to blast myself, but I think I'd much prefer to build myself over there. Just in case. Just in case. So let's just throw out. Let me see what do I don't need. I can put the magma here. Because my uh, flamethrower is already filled up to the brim. Okay, let's uh, let's get a stack of uh, this. 64. Like that. Okay, we are ready. Now we just need to head on straight. Okay. So guys, now you know. If you're stuck in the nether, 
Just build yourself another nether, nether portal. Well, at least don't throw out the flint and steel until you leave the nether. Bring your flint and steel with you. It's pretty important. Ah, there we go. We made it. Baby, we made it. Okay, so um, maybe this won't be enough, but I will try and get these obsidian blocks. Oh, look at that. There is a, there is a building at the top left corner. I'm not sure what that is, but I could check it out. Okay, I need to re uh, remake the portal somehow. Maybe m maybe these blocks will be enough. Maybe it won't be. We'll see. Wither helmet lets your attackers wither. That's actually a pretty interesting helmet. I will take it with me. And we have some obsidian. Seven obsidian. Is this enough, guys? Is this enough? I guess we'll we'll never know. We will never know. Let's uh, do this. That, like that. Like that. Like this. Oh, let's go, baby. Saved, guys. Saved. Let's get the flint and steel. I'm ready to go back wherever it takes me. I do not care. And I'm ready to shoot my flower gun. Also, get a nut. Oh, get an ender pearl. Yes, there we go. Okay. Oh, it's been a long time coming. But <laughs> let's also uh, get this one just in case. Fire link. I'm ready to TP out, ender pearl out, or grapple myself out of any situation. Let's go. Subspace bubble. What? No. No. Where am I? What is this? This is so far away from my base, I bet. There's no way I'm close to my base. Oh, no. So, there's snow here. There's snow everywhere. Uh, can I even leave this place? The freedom. The freedom of the overworld. Let's go. You know what, guys? In... In, um, in commemoration to our survival and our very close calls, I will, I will be the best survivor I can be. I'm gonna, I will get the cod and the berries for them survivors. Not because I want to be their friend, but because I want to just be a good guy. I'm so thankful for being back. Now I could probably, oh, you know what, before before I do use my fire link, I will check out this chest right here. Because maybe this chest is um, storing pretty good loots for us. No way. No way, guys. No way. Oh, oh. Down. 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 Get, get, oh, get away from me. Okay, um, let's get this guy. He wants a little bit. We can, we can totally give it, give it back to him. Okay, guys, look at this. We are on a lucky streak because the luck is in our favor. We found an enchanting table. This will be very, very useful soon. And we, we even got some books. Yeah, you know what? We need the books. Let's get the books as well. If only I could build a base in this area here. Look at it. It's so beautiful, so peaceful, and so open. Um... But the neighbors like to stare for whatever reason through the windows. Don't look at me. Oh, no. I hate these guys. I, ha I, I hate these guys. When they spawn in, they just spawn in here all the time. Not not this exact place, but um, they spawn in. That means they will be spawning in here all the time. That means, oh, even more books. That means that it's, uh, it's a pretty bad place for a base because I really do not want to get swung like that. But, oh, we can see a village. Either way, we will try now the fire link yet again. Oh, you know what, guys? Before I try the fire link, I will check out, um, check out the village and also the radio tower because that's a lucky, that's a lucky, um, drop. That's a lucky spawn. If, if it does have any, anything cool, that'd be, like, pretty cool. You always have to check the radio towers. Hmm, guys, not the radio towers, but there are hospitals and uh, huge buildings of sorts all over here, which is uh, still pretty good. Still pretty good. Okay, um, no chests. No, no chest. Villager, you trade, no? Okay, well, keep safe. I'm gonna close the door for you. Keep on being safe. Okay, I'm ready to teleport. Oh, damn, I'm ready to teleport out. Oh, let's go. 
We made it. We made it back home. I'm so happy. Oh, look at that. There are... There are creatures now spawning again. <laughs> oh, no. That's not good. That is not good at all. The spore creatures are infecting right around my base. But we're... I'm, I'm very glad to be back home. It's been a long time coming, but here we are, finally. Why is that thing here? Get away! Get away as well. Good, 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 good. Okay, let's uh, let's get let's get a crafting bench going. We're gonna kind of build the oh greenery. Greenery is overtaking my base, bro. What are you doing? Why is he on top of you? I'm gonna shoot you with a bow. There you go. I hear one from behind me as well. Oh no. Is the bow not good enough? Look at its size. Look at the size of the bow. It should be good enough. Let's uh, break his arm. Get this guy. Okay, good, good, good. We're gonna keep it. By the way, we do also have spectral arrows. Which, uh, do they do any good damage to these things? Oh yeah, they do. They are pretty good. Okay, that's good to so you know that the spectral arrows are chill like that. Okay. And I just wasted that. Well, either way, we weren't gonna use it anywho, so it doesn't really matter if we lose it. I was gonna craft also um, an axe, but for the axe, now I need everything. Ever, ever, everything. Okay. I think I left it in the chest. Are you serious, bro? Maybe I can craft it here, or should I go back? I think I need to go back. Okay, we're gonna go back and see the base real quick. Without taking too much damage. We are very delicate um, system of uh, survival. Yep, definitely. Do this. Do this. Oh yeah, beautiful, beautiful. We have one fleshy bone. Let's also get another fleshy bone. Good. Now we can finally craft the infected armaments. It's been a long time coming, but here we are. And this thing, it looks pretty crazy. It's pretty chat. Let's check it out a little bit closer. You know what? Let's check it out here, actually. Oh, yeah. It is pretty chat. Let's also get a shield going, guys. Where's the shield? I know I have a shield, but where is it? Am I blind? Did I put it here? I think I did. Yeah. There we go. Let's put on a shield. Are we ready to fight the Titan Warrior? You tell me, guys. I, I, I don't know myself. But I'm pretty sure we are getting pretty geared up in this uh, kind of uh, the spore, the Last of Us invasion type of deal. And I think maybe I'm ready to finally meet the faction leaders. Even though I don't have a faction of my own, I can still hold my own. I can hold my ground, definitely. But I can't hold my front yard. It's bombed. And it's crazy, it's destroyed. But still, I think we should proceed. Okay, I've been preparing for this battle for a very long time. Very long time. Okay, first of all, let's try and hit that guy with the bow. It seems the the invasion didn't stop. It was just a wave of one. A little guy was checking out the place. Now, there's a big guy right in front of my base, on my lawn. No. Ain't happening. I'm gonna shoot him with a bow. Is this a good distance? Oh, need to go even lower? This bow's great. Oh, there we go. Yeah, you're not running away, you big rat. You big, you big, you big doofus. Let's get that guy. Okay, can I shoot him from here? Oh yeah, I can. Just a little higher. Maybe you guys can't see it too well. So I will whip out my crabber. Kraber, and I will show you. Oh, no. Oh, there he is. There he is. Look at him! He's going inside the building! There is nothing inside that building! Let's try and get him. Okay, there is nothing inside of that building. Why, what, what does he want from there? Okay, guys, I think I need to maybe go a little bit lower. Oh, he is breaking blocks. I need to get over to him, away from my base. What if he gets on top of my base and destroys it? That, that would not be good. That would not be good. Okay, let's get the high artillery out. <laughs> Of course, by that I mean the airplane, guys. And let's uh, send in the bombardments. Bombardments away. Woo! Let's go! Let's go! Fire him up! Put him on fire! Put him on fire! Let's get it, guys! Let's get it! Oh, yeah! Just like this! Yeah, 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 yeah! 
Oh yeah, he is blowing up. He is not happy about it. Oh, th this invasion, it's gonna hit my base real soon if there's... Oh, damn. Oh, I survived. I survived. Yep, guys, you, you know the usual. Usually it happens. Okay, let's run away a little bit. There he is. He missed. Get this guy. Run away. Like that. Set up a few munitions systems. Like that. So he... He'd walk in there. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, the munition system got him. Oh, damn, they are going everywhere, mayhem. Okay, I think I think the munition system got him. I think that's good. We're good. I repelled him. I repelled the most serious invasion that we had yet on our base with munition systems. Turns out they are a one sap, a one shot, which is uh can't complain. Can't complain, guys. But yeah, this ground, oh, it's gonna go under real soon. Get this guy. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, well, either way. I'm really happy that we did repel him. Okay, finally we can sleep the night. I'm pretty sure, guys, this is the final night. Holy, we made it. There's no way. There's no way. This was way too difficult. And after, after this, guys, I'm planning on recording a scary mod pack video. 100 days. And that one is supposed to be even harder than this. I am not sure how I'm gonna do this, but... We can try, we can try, right guys? We can definitely try and survive it. Plus, I won't be surviving alone. I will be surviving with a buddy, with a friend, which, uh, which will make things not easier, might I say. It's not gonna be easier. It will be a little bit more difficult. Uh, that's it, guys. That's it. We made it. Day 100. Congratulations. Pat yourself on the back. I'm gonna pat myself on the back. It was difficult. It was tiresome. It was very very nerve-wracking, but we we somehow did it. I am I am sort of looking to a part two with enhanced mods and enhanced difficulty, but uh, a part two, 200 days guys. If you really want it, let me know down in the comments. Make sure to click like, subscribe, and also leave a comment that you do want to see a part two to this uh, The Last of Us Apocalypse. And maybe, just maybe, I will make it a little bit more difficult. It's not up to me, guys. It will be a lot more difficult. If if I can't survive 200 days more here, I'm super geared already. It's gonna be very difficult enhancing this mod pack because I'm not sure what I should even add. Uh, a lot more bosses, that's for sure. Wave Waves of uh, zombies coming at you, definitely. A lot more zombie spawns, most definitely. The skulk or whatever, the spore invasion, way more deadlier, way more faster and serious. Can I can't even make a base in part two. That's right. Part two will be sick. But yeah, guys, this is it for now. It's me, 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 me as always, Ender Fizz, guys. And I really hope you enjoyed this one. And yeah, see you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye-bye.